the tools are out because the car went dead going down the road. After stopping safely in the grassy shoulder of the highway, preliminary tests revealed a dead battery, completely dead. Further tests revealed a failed alternator. The battery was only two years old. Put the amp meter on the alternator and sure enough, nothing. No amps, no charging. Of course the battery went flat, but it went flat without a flashing warning light indicator. What are you gonna do? Holy moly! Oh my! Here's the problem. The connection crumbled away so easily that I almost fell into the engine bay. Just look at this connection. I've never seen that before. Have you? It has been hot. With the repeated cycles of way overheating, it's time. What time? It's new alternator time. And can you believe it? While being stranded on the highway, and in these times of high crime and COVID, several motorists offered assistance. After accepting a ride home from one of them, the amazement and surprise of all the kindness shown was, well, surprisingly amazing. Now, where were we? Oh yeah, we're in the middle of this wire cooking cleanup class. Yeah. That cooked hot wire was cleaned up, shined up, and then covered up with electrician's tape where the original insulation had been degraded from the excessive and repeat of heat cycles. Such a pretty new alternator, look at it. So pretty. What a sweetheart it is. Good terminal. Bad terminal. Even a novice can tell the difference. An automotive top job is always appreciated and such clean work compared to a job that requires having to crawl underneath the car. Yep good times, such fun, and it's full speed ahead. With only six bolts and a detention of the serpentine belt, this is less than an hour's work. Work? Who said that? It's always a good idea to disconnect the battery so as not to damage electronics. So let's hook the battery back up as well. And then there is the decorative engine cover to replace to make it all lovely again, as well as functional. And look, it runs. But is it charging? Test and see. Yes, it is charging. All is well again. With that shiny new alternator sparkling under the hood, might as well gussy up the engine bay with slick mist to make the rest of it shine as well. There it is. That's the stuff. And the motor runs so quiet, all that can be heard is the background music. One last look under the hood for tools and fingers before slamming the lid on it. Job over. Time for a joyride. Hoorah! On the road again, I just can't wait to get back on the road again. And I can't wait to get on the road again.